Hi, my name is Stacy Paris. I had the honor of competing for the Fannin County Lady Rebels from 1995 through 1999. I played basketball for four years, softball for four years, and ran track for one year. After my Fannin County career, I played basketball for North Georgia College and State University from 1999 to 2003. I started out school at Epworth Elementary School. Um, I think that's where my first competitiveness came from, playing with all my friends on the, the playground with tag and on the merry-go-round, and that's kind of where it all began. I began practicing when I was just a young kid in my parents' driveway, hoping that one day I would get a chance to play for the Lady Rebels and Coach Farmer. From that time, I always looked up to the players that were years ahead of me. Um, I was fortunate enough to have parents who supported me, never missed a game, and shuttled me around to all of the games that I was playing. When I was a kid, I fell in love with basketball the most. I enjoyed the competitiveness and working together as a team. I've carried the lessons I've learned with sports all throughout my life. What I remember most from my years of playing was the journey to get to the one goal that I always had, a state championship. That started my freshman year in high school with the 95-96 team. We made it all the way to the Final Four that year and had the opportunity to play with some great players. My sophomore year, we were a young group. Um, we worked hard throughout the season to be successful. Um, toward the end of the season, we went through a big challenge of, of losing a former teammate, Sabrina Gibson. Um, that helped us fuel some fire to play for her and make a run for the state title. Um, we finished second that year, playing with a heart and emotion from losing her. During that time, I had the opportunity to hit three consecutive game winners in the state playoffs. We came up short in the finals, but we gave everything we had that year. My junior year, we had a great year, but we ended up getting knocked out in the early round of the state playoffs. Um, so that set everything up for our senior year as a team. Um, we finished the season 29-1 and and state champions. That was the only goal for me and our five seniors is I couldn't imagine not winning that state title and, and leaving my Fannin County career behind. Um, we had plenty of solid performances throughout the year. We played as a team. But it all came down to one game against Putnam County in Macon, Georgia. I don't know if there's ever been a moment that we've been more focused and I've been more focused to, and determined to do something. We came out dominating, and then through working together, we won. And I was able to come out with the best game of my career with 40 points in the state title game. I and the team couldn't have asked for a more storybook ending. Sharing in the joy of winning the state title with my teammates, my parents, my family, friends, fans, and coaches, um, and anyone else who was part of our journey throughout the four years. My career at Fannin County allowed me to have a full scholarship to North Georgia and have the opportunity to play on some great championship teams with some outstanding players. I walked away with a degree in business marketing with no college debt. I'm extremely fortunate to be able to say that. There are so many people that I want to thank. Um, first and foremost, I want to thank my parents for always being there to support me, to taking the games through, you know, attending all the games throughout my career. Um, my teammates, you know, they made it so wonderful. You know, we were able to achieve so much, and it's incredibly special. I get to take all those memories with me. You know, Coach Farmer and, and Coach Payne, I can't think enough. Um, they're some of the, the best coaches you could possibly ask for, and they brought out the best um, in me and all of us. And then all the fans and anyone else that was along the way that supported us through that journey, um, I, I can't thank you enough. It's, it's an honor to be included in such um, athletes for the Fannin County. Mm -hmm.